Welcome to Modular. Our mission is to democratize AI compute by eliminating fragmentation and complexity from infrastructure. We are unlocking the full power of the world's AI hardware, enabling researchers and developers to innovate faster than ever before. To do this, we're building the world's first unified AI developer platform, one that runs seamlessly across diverse hardware without sacrificing performance. We want you to develop faster, program more easily, and scale to thousands of GPUs with an AI stack that gives you full power over advanced features while enabling portability across different architectures. We have several big updates for you today, including something special for the Pythonistas. But to kick things off, I'd like to introduce Vamsi Bopana from AMD. We're truly in a golden age of AI, and at AMD, we're proud to deliver world-class compute for the next generation of large-scale inference and training workloads. Our Instinct family of accelerators offer exceptional performance, advanced architectural features, and market-leading TCO, helping customers push the boundaries of what's possible in AI. We also know that great hardware alone is not enough. We've invested deeply in open software with Rockham, empowering developers and researchers with the tools they need to build, optimize, and scale AI systems on AMD. This is why we are excited to partner with Modular. By bringing Modular to AMD, we're thrilled to extend the capabilities of our OpenAI ecosystem. I'm thrilled that we can empower developers and researchers to build the future of AI. Best wishes to the Modular team. We are excited for what's ahead. Thanks, Vamsi. We're thrilled to be part of this journey and excited to support your upcoming GPU launches. Modular's mission to democratize AI compute required a fundamental rethink of the tools developers use to build, deploy, and scale AI. The result is the industry's first truly unified AI stack. Modular gives you a single binary that runs across diverse hardware, rather than multiple different implementations all kind of trying to be compatible with each other. This dramatically simplifies deployment allows seamless use of heterogeneous accelerators, and empowers developers to write high-performance, portable algorithms. Now, let's connect the dots. Today, I'm thrilled to announce that Mojo and Max are generally available on AMD. We now support their most powerful MI300 and 325 data center GPUs. With this launch, developers can now use Modular to seamlessly tap into the best AI hardware for their workload, unlocking high-performance compute for any application. Finally, our partner TensorWave is offering free AMD compute so you can test out the Modular platform today. Sign up on modular.com slash TensorWave. Now, I'll hand it to Tim and Eric to share more about what Modular can do for you. Thanks, Chris, EJ. How epic was that? Now with AMD support, Modular offers a single platform to run multiple GPUs across. Yeah, Tim, this is super exciting. With support for both AMD and NVIDIA GPUs on a unified stack, Moving between the latest hardware has never been easier. And as you know, mate, since we started, we've long believed that the future of AI was going to be empowered by open infrastructure that's programmable, portable, and of course, performant. Yeah, it's a true research to production platform. And that's why we spent the last three years building the modular platform, a truly heterogeneous stack that enables you to serve, deploy, and optimize models across many GPUs and CPUs. Yeah, and the most interesting thing about the modular platform is it's the only vertically integrated hardware agnostic stack in the world. Yeah. From orchestration in Kubernetes to blazing fast model serving, all the way down to low level hardware optimizations. And one of our goals has been to make life easier for developers and enterprises. No more dependency hell, no more rewriting a model for each GPU vendor, just a single container, a single container that enables you to get the best performance you can for your AI workloads. And it's all now optimized for AMD GPUs. But enough of the talk. Navroop, let's see the demo. Thanks, EJ. Max provides several different libraries, including a high-performance serving library that enables you to inference on the most popular Gen AI models out of the box on AMD and NVIDIA hardware. With support for portability across these GPUs, Max is truly the easiest and most performant way to run inference on your models. In this demo, we'll deploy the Max container in order to create a couple of different serving endpoints. First, you'll want to pull down the Max Docker container from our public Docker Hub. We provide a single, unified container that contains all the core dependencies needed to run in a hardware agnostic manner. Let's start with NVIDIA. I'm running on a host here that has a H100 80 gig GPU attached. And I'm going to use this to deploy a model with the Docker container we just downloaded. 
I can pass the Hugging Face model ID for the model that we want to use. This will transparently run models on our natively optimized Max Graphs format for even faster performance, which we'll touch on later in the presentation. This spins up a REST endpoint that's OpenAI compatible with no extra setup required. Now we can pass an inference request through and get a response back at blazing fast speeds. Check this out. I'm going to send a curl request with OpenAI chat completion API spec. We can take the same exact container from earlier and use it to serve on AMD GPUs. The best part? All of this just works out of the box. Max unlocks the fastest inference on AMD hardware in just minutes. In fact, here's how Max compares to existing infrastructure. And here's how AMD and NVIDIA performance compare directly. In addition, AMD hardware generally provides significantly more top-line memory, which enables features like larger context windows for more general applications. With Max, you can run popular Gen AI models on the hardware that gives you industry-leading performance per dollar, reducing your overall costs while maintaining the throughput and quality your application requires. Thanks, Navarut. That was epic. You might not know it, but Max already supports thousands of models out of the box, from PyTorch Eager models to Max models, our most optimized native graph format. Yeah, for most developers, out-of-the-box Max will support the vast majority of your AI inference yeah. applications. However, for advanced developers looking to invent the future, do research, we've also got you covered. We've made available the same APIs and tools we use internally yeah. to serve, build, and tune the performance of our industry-leading models and kernels. Yeah, it's really everything you need to take control of the end-to-end -end AI stack, to write novel algorithms, and hit the roof line on AMD and NVIDIA GPUs. And it's why enterprises like InWorld and a bunch of others are choosing to work with Modular. To show you how easy it is, I'm going to throw it over to Brad for a demo. New AI research and algorithms often come with a hidden cost. They're hard to implement efficiently across diverse hardware systems. At Modular, we are changing that. We make it easy to bring research to production and enable full use of any hardware, including AMD GPUs. A simple pip install max, gets you everything the modular platform provides, including Mojo, our high-performance programming language. Mojo is a Python family language designed from the ground up to easily unlock the best performance on a variety of hardware. Unlike most programming languages that are primarily targeted at CPUs, Mojo is built for the new era of heterogeneous computing across GPUs and other accelerators. Here's what that means. On the left, we've got a traditional CUDA implementation of a parallel algorithm running on GPUs. On the right, the exact same algorithm written in Mojo. Less code, more readable, and thanks to features like strong static typing, compile time metaprogramming, and seamless hardware dispatch, it's far easier to write and maintain. And because it's a brand new programming language, it's not locked to one hardware system. On the left, we have an example of Mojo code that will run on an NVIDIA GPU, and on the right, the exact same code that will execute on an AMD MI300X. Let's run them side by side. And you see that the results are identical on either GPU. Modular's platform drives state-of-the-art performance on modern GPUs with very readable code. For example, here's some of the source code of our fastest matrix multiplication kernel on AMD MI300X. And here's how it matches up with the most hand-tuned code in the world. So how do you use Mojo in your AI stack? The good news is that if you run one of our optimized Max models, you already are. Our Max Graph Python APIs give you full control to build or customize entire models with our leading edge open source Mojo kernels under the hood and you can easily swap in your own custom kernels. Brad, that was incredible. But you might be wondering, how much of this is open source? Well, Tim, we're not keeping it to ourselves. Mm -hmm. We've open sourced the vast majority of Macs. The kernels, the serving APIs, and the reference models are now live on GitHub. That's more than 450,000 lines of code. 450,000 lines of code? That's crazy, man. That might actually be the most GPU kernel code ever open sourced. It might be, but who's counting? It's a lot, Tim. <laughs> Well, it's all out there now in our GitHub repo, 
And you can contribute under an Apache 2 license and help us build the future of AI infrastructure. But high performance inference is just one part of the AI deployment story. As you scale, mm -hmm. Gen AI inference requires intelligent orchestration, not just serving. We've actually heard from enterprises and developers alike, they want a fully distributed system that can handle trillions of tokens online. Yeah, they really want a truly hardware agnostic system that can help push GPU utilization to its max. And that's why today we're introducing something brand new. We call it Mammoth. It's our Kubernetes native cloud service that allows you to deploy, scale, and manage your Gen AI applications with state-of-the-art performance. Yeah, I mean, Mammoth is truly epic. and The name is even more legendary. Let's hand it over to Deep for a demo. Thanks, Tim. Deploying Mammoth in your cluster is as easy as running one command. Mammoth is now up and running in your cluster. Behind the scenes, our kubectl plugin spins up an intelligent control plane that manages everything from model deployment to intelligent autoscaling. Let's deploy a model. We'll use the Gemma 3 12 billion model. Just tell Mammoth which model to run and how many GPUs to use, and he handles the rest. It automatically deploys the model on available NVIDIA or AMD GPUs. Here, the model gets assigned on AMD MI300 node. In production, scaling is essential. So let's scale this up to five replicas. You see, new pods are being spun up now, ready to serve request. But hey, let's look a little closer. Some of these replicas are now running on the NVIDIA H100 node. This isn't a fluke. It's the power and promise of Mammoth. True hardware independence unified across NVIDIA and AMD GPUs. The best part? This comes built in with no extra configuration required. Mammoth goes way far beyond basic deployments. It comes with advanced optimizations like disaggregate inference built in. These optimizes give you over 2x performance improvements over traditional solutions. Let's now deploy DeepSeq R1 Distilled Llama 70 billion model in disaggregated mode. And it's alive. Mammoth automatically splits the workload across available hardwares and it hides away the complexity related to KV cache transfers, inter GPU communication, and scheduling. Mammoth is built for performance, but designed for simplicity. Using Mammoth in your application is just as seamless. It is a single endpoint for all your models. Here are the live requests being served by Mammoth endpoint. No custom serving stack required and no extra engineering. Just easy to use fast inference at scale and now on any GPU. Deploying and managing multiple models in production across diverse hardware has never been this simple. The future of AI infrastructure isn't coming. It's here and we're just getting started. And with that, we're excited to announce the Mammoth is in public preview now. Go to modular.com slash mammoth to request early access. And with that, back to you, Tim. Amazing deep, Mammoth. Again, such an epic product. Now anyone can take advantage of large scaled distributed inference infrastructure. And it's available today in Alpha. Just contact us. And with that, Eric, we're done. What a huge set of announcements. Actually, Tim, we're not done. Wait, what? We've got something else we've been cooking up. What is it? What happens when you supercharge Python with Mojo? You get a fire-breathing Python? Uh, sort of. Let's hand over to Brad to show us the future of Python. Python is an amazing language that has enabled rapid development of incredible applications, from AI to bioinformatics. But while it's easy to work with, it isn't always the fastest way to implement intensive algorithms. Eliminating Python bottlenecks has often meant building completely separate code in a different language, drawing from separate areas of expertise. You've seen the hardware portable power of Mojo for driving GPUs. Now you can use Mojo directly from Python, as if it was Python, only with the hot rod speed that Mojo provides. Let's see an example in action. So this is the same Mojo code we saw running earlier on the GPU, only now if we switch to a Python file right next to it, we can see that we're importing this Mojo file as a Python module and calling it as a Python function. That Mojo code is still running at full speed and even running on the attached MI300X GPU. This makes it incredibly easy to progressively migrate hotspots in your Python code to fast Mojo that is still as readable as your original Python. You can also use Mojo to progressively enhance your existing PyTorch models, like this example calculation. 
by dropping Mojo custom operators directly into your models to accelerate the most demanding layers. No complicated build system, no language interface glue, just readable yet high performance code. This really lights a fire under your Python applications and we can't wait to see what you do with it. Wow, what an incredible way to end. Such an exciting set of announcements. Totally, and all these features are available right now in our nightly releases. You mean it's all available today? Yeah. Amazing. To bring it to a close, everyone at Modular is working so hard to make this platform go far and we want your help to shape it. Bring your ideas, bring your models, bring your imagination and your passion. Let's build the future of AI together. It all starts at modular.com. See you next time and stay awesome.